Hey, sorry for the quick hiatus. I'm back now. I don't know when this is going up, but I plan to post this Friday, Saturday. So either the 10th or the 11th. Just wanted to say some updates on the channel and the channel status as a whole. I am going to continue to post, but I don't think I'm going to post the rest of my vlogs. It's too time consuming to constantly be uploading them and deleting them on Google Drive and my phone just because I have so much footage from week three, four, and when I switched coaches. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do the start of my new coach, my four week peak, and then my max out. Hopefully I am get caught up by June and then we figure it out from there. Okay, enjoy the video. I'll see you guys. You guys probably won't even be able to see me, but took a well needed nap today. It was like super important that I get a nap in because if not, then I don't think I would have been able to be up today, right? The gym closes at 8 and it's already 7.40 so I have to go to a different location so I'm going to be yapping for a little longer than I usually do. Hopefully it's not too packed right now. If it is, I'm going to off myself in game. I'm still debating on which ones to go. This dumbass. I'm still debating on which one to go to but I think I'm going to go to the one that's better for deadlift more streamlined more polished i mean today is only a three by six so it's nothing crazy right it's it's only it's at a six again i might even do 365 for a pause like a top side pause and then go down to like 355 or stay at 365, oh, you can see me. Or stay at 365 for the majority of the sets. And then I have like some hamstring curls. I have, yeah, I have a main squat day tomorrow. And then I have a, that's my mother. I just passed my mother on the road. Main squat day, Saturday is Saturday, so tomorrow. And then I have, a two day break before I go back into my day one, which is good. These platforms, I can't put the bar on the floor like I usually can at the location that I usually go to at 24. However, these platforms tend to have a lot more shock absorption because they're newer deadlift platforms that are meant for Olympic lifters. So I'm assuming that if I can full reset with them, I should be okay. Also, I haven't had any back problems, knock on wood, I haven't had any back problems since my SPD belt arrived, since I bought it, which is a good thing. So hopefully I can, you know, just, just hit what I need to hit today. I'm probably only gonna record deadlift, which is why I'm talking for a little longer and why I'm going to a different location. My body overall doesn't feel that sore. I think I've been treating it pretty good, not pushing it too much. My 445 was really fast still at a six, even while I'm trying to figure out hinging. I am gonna do some slack pulls today, conventional and sumo, just to figure out what I can do, what I can't do, what I'm able to figure out. I'm probably gonna watch the video again. I should probably be doing that instead of recording myself. Okay, I'll see you guys in the gym. I'm probably only going to record deadlift and then you guys are going to see me afterwards and then we'll go from there. It's going to be a quick workout today. Quick workout. Bye. 
fucking clip on the other side. Am I retarded? Oh, okay. 